Hi to all. My name is Venkat. I am the facilitator and founder of this particular organization. Now today, I would be giving little more about this particular technology, why it is becoming so popular and the facilitator and knowledgeable people who are working for the industry is very few people outside. What the things I'm going to be cover as part of this particular technology, you supposed to be understand because this particular embedded automation testing is the technology which can be call it as you know multidisciplinary or maybe a interdisciplinary technology. Let me show you what the things I am going to be cover as part of this particular content of course. You know, firstly, we must understand why this particular technology is significantly playing a role in our day-to-day -day life. And uh, what what what's the main difference between the embedded system technology as well as an internet of things? These two technologies are becoming together working in fact. Embedded system technology is very older. Even most of the electronics as well as electrical technological people, they are well aware and they are developing in fact all the products in the field of embedded technology. But slowly now, most of the computer science people, electronics people are learning there is a hot technology called as an internet of things. What's, what's the difference between these particular two technologies you should understand because most of the graduates like BTEC students have their labs are available at a college, infrastructure available at a college. Why this particular technology is, is very important. In fact, you might believe or not, past few years I have seen that, you know, in most of the universities and engineering colleges, electrical, electronic, mechanical, civil engineering branches have been deflated because those particular branches subset to this particular technology. Deflating a particular technology does not mean those technologies are not available in the market. Those technologies are mandatory and they are very essential as per my knowledge because their, their role is going to become a, you know, negligible we can say subset of the part they have percentage of the applications becoming little low isn't it so internet of things is the technology where most of the electronic appliances and mechanical appliances are integrated together in order to perform a particular task isn't it in fact i can say embedded system is going to be a subset for the internet of things technology it is becoming a branch Internet of Things is a branch now, as like as a CSC, as like as an IT, yes or no. So embedded system is it's independently, it cannot be worked properly. If we, if we able to integrate Internet of Things with the embedded system concept, the product is going to become a, a vital role. Everybody would expect from that. Let's suppose a driverless car. Now human presence is not required. So everything, everything, the surroundings are going to be analyzed car is going to be analyzed what are the objects are surrounding it what kind of a prediction or how after how much time the car is going to be uh, reached to particular product like a lot of sensors we have with which uh, so embedded system is going to be becoming very popular because it is going to be integrated with the sensors uh, along with the concept as called as you know internet is going to become a backbone for this so therefore we cannot isolate embedded system and iot as a different technologies we have to be learn these two technologies are going to be a one particular discipline it is going to be a multi multidisciplinary technology right so you know rather than btech vallu ala kaakunda bsc electronics vallu msc electronics vallu BCA qualification on isn't it? MBA qualification on the background wala, ye technology ardam kaka pochu, kani mana day to day life, ye technology na mana wadu untam. Our mobile is the best product where it is considered as embedded system device. Kani the embedded system device a kada na mana filid, mana bike on the bike law, mana break yangane lights of say. Blue lights, like LED lights, change counter. Whenever you you keep a leg on a brake, 
automatically certain lights are going to be visible to you in order to give a message in order to give the prompting to other people in order to highlight their device yes or no so manam you chese prati chota even though ippudu okappudu manam hospital ku velli mana bp sugar anni manam check cheyinche vallam ippudu mana smart manam you chese watch lone మన యొక్క బీపీని మెజర్ చేయొచ్చు షుగర్ని మెజర్ చేయొచ్చు మన హార్ట్ బీట్ని మెజర్ చేయొచ్చు మన బ్లడ్ ప్రెషర్ని మేజర్ చేయొచ్చు వీటికన్నింటిని మనము ఎంబడెడ్ సిస్టమ్ డివైజెస్ అని అంటాం కానీ మనము ఇప్పుడు నేర్చుకునే టెక్నాలజీలో డివైజెస్ మార్కెట్లోకి వస్తాయి మనం వాడుతూ ఉంటాం కానీ అవి కరెక్ట్గా వర్క్ అవుతున్నాయా లేదా అని చెక్ చేసే రెస్పాన్సిబిలిటీ ఆటోమేటెడ్ ఎంబడెడ్ సిస్టమ్ టెస్టింగ్ ఇంజనీర్స్ ఆ రెస్పాన్సిబిలిటీ సో ఏ ప్రోడక్ట్ అయినా సాఫ్ట్వేర్ ప్రోడక్ట్ అయినా హార్డ్వేర్ ఎలక్ట్రానిక్ ప్రోడక్ట్ అయినా మార్కెట్లో రిలీజ్ చేయాలి అంటే ఆ ప్రోడక్ట్ యొక్క అక్యురసీ లెవెల్స్ అంటే ఎంత పర్ఫెక్ట్గా అది సర్వీస్ని ఇస్తుంది అని క్యాలిక్యులేట్ చేసి వెరిఫై చేసి వ్యాలిడేషన్ చేసి దాన్ని మార్కెట్లో రిలీజ్ చేయాలి యాజ్ లాంగ్ యాజ్ ద సాఫ్ట్వేర్ ఇండస్ట్రీ అండ్ హార్డ్వేర్ ఇండస్ట్రీ విల్ బి దేర్ ఇన్ ద మార్కెట్ దిస్ ఆటోమేటెడ్ ఎంబడెడ్ టెస్టింగ్ అండ్ ఆటోమేషన్ టెస్టింగ్ మాన్యువల్ టెస్టింగ్ all three together will be work as a part of a, a system which is a pipeline idu lekonda adu ledu adu lekonda idu ledu so everything is mandatory right so ee particular technology nerchukodaniki ee particular vaalla eligible particular vaalla eligible ledu anedi ledu see i am the facilitator i am the resource person where i am going to teach this particular subject i trained almost 5 lakhs about people so far everybody from interdisciplinary backgrounds including ba people i have placed because it's an ability to learn the things because the generation gap iq levels you have more and more everything can be you guys can understand therefore as per my knowledge i can recommend you strongly so far there will be technologies are rocking the world కొంతమంది ఫుల్ స్టాక్ జావా నేర్చుకుంటారు కొంతమంది ఫుల్ స్టాక్ పైథాన్ నేర్చుకుంటారు కొంతమంది ఈ హెచ్టిఎంఎల్ టెక్నాలజీ ఈజీగా ఉంటుందని నేర్చుకుంటున్నారు కొంతమంది బిజినెస్ ఇంటెలిజెన్స్ టూల్స్ ఈజీగా మనము డేటా అనాలిసిస్ చేయొచ్చు అని పవర్ బిఏ అని ట్యాబ్ల్యూ అని కొన్ని టెక్నాలజీస్ నేర్చుకొని ఒక స్టేజ్కి వెళ్ళిపోయిన తర్వాత వాళ్ళకి ఆ యొక్క టెక్నాలజీ యొక్క అప్లికేషన్స్ లేక ప్రాజెక్ట్స్ లేక ఎంప్లాయీస్కి బెంచ్లో పెట్టి వాళ్ళని రిమూవ్ చేసేస్తున్నారు so therefore i can tell you you know meeru existing employees aina meer okka sari demo krandi okka sari meer chuste 40 years 35 years 50 years vallu common ga vastunnaru endukante yes so ee ee technology nerchukodaniki age to limit ledu but ee technology ni enduku nerchukoranante this is the world next inkoka 100 samvatsaralane ide technology nadustundi so therefore try to be focused do that survey learn the technology that is my conclusion and my recommendation to you guys who wanted to learn this particular technology thank you so much for your patience to listen this demonstration